This video takes a look at using Dratus on Backtrack 5R2. Dratus is a tool in which you can organize targets that are found during scans of the network, Nessa scans, Qualys scans, and scans made by other tools. Backtrack 5 comes with Dratus 2.7 or lower, and the import in version 2.7 and lower can be slow for some of these imports. So it's not a bad idea to update to Dratus 2.9. To do that, you need to first update to Ruby 3.2 or higher because Dratus 2.9 requires at least Ruby 3.2 in order to store its output and create the server. To start with Dratus, we're going to go to pen test, miscellaneous, and Dratus. In this folder is a reset script used when you first install Dratus or install a new version of Dratus. The server folder where all the executables actually run and a start script which starts the server inside of the server folder. The verify script is used to verify that all the dependencies are satisfied when doing a new installation. We're going to use the start script to start the server. And it should start running by default on port 3009, localhost. And it's a web server. If you look at the output during the startup script, it'll tell you exactly which port it's running on. This one's running on HTTPS, localhost 3009. Go ahead and start Firefox. You can log in with any name. Dratus supports collaboration, so different people can log into the same server and work together. The password is set by you when you first install the server. So to start your project, you can add a branch. Afterwards, you can import your Nessus and nmap scans using the uploader. So click the import from file button, it'll open up a new tab, choose the import type. In this case, start with Nessus. And we have a Nessus report that we output earlier in the .nessus format from Nessus 5. Go ahead and update that. And then as it updates, it'll add the files here as a new branch. When that's done, we can also go ahead and update by adding an nmap scan that we created earlier. And we save this as an XML file. It's important when you output from nmap to output as XML in order to be able to import into Dratus and Metasploit Community Edition and other tools. Use the dash OX option to output XML and nmap. Once we get everything uploaded, we can move these new branches under our main branch by dragging them up and dropping them. We can delete the uploaded nodes. And now we have our Nessus import under our home network main root. And we also have our nmap and import under that as well. You can create subfolders as you see fit, and then simply drag them into place. And we can see that the imports are well organized. Metasploit Community Edition has a similar feature where you can import Nmap and Nessa scans, and it'll organize the input in a similar fashion by IP address, port, and service running.